and we are back hey guys how are you doing hopefully you're having a great day um as you guys saw that is a pike or a lake trout See oh my god let's see if we can track it down that was massive that thing was 50 inches i'm not kidding you what was that it looks like a sturgeon almost. It was so big. I'm not kidding you guys, okay? No. Don't don't laugh at me like that. No, that fish was ginormous. What else is there in here that could be that big? A lake trout. It's probably a lake trout. If it's a pike or a muskie, it's the same girth as me. Like I was saying, it is still opener. Um, we just had some lunch, as you guys saw from the video I just posted um, in the morning. We caught a bunch of fish, did really good for numbers, but we just didn't get on anything too big. So in the afternoon here, we're going to try some new water um, and uh, cover as much water as we can in hopes of finding some bigger, pudgier uh, smallmouth bass. So yeah, I guess this is kind of like a part two of Lake Simcoe opener. Uh, just two separate videos. So let's see what we can do this afternoon uh, before we gotta head back in. That was ginormous. I wish I got a better look at it. No, I'm not kidding you. of rocks there that we're casting to right now. Let's see. Anyone home? Let's crash you. That was quick. <laughs> Choked it, Aaron. Oh my goodness. Actually choked it, eh? No, like... Oh. Yeah. Gone. Yeah. They don't eat gobies in Lake Simcoe, guys. They don't eat gobies. <laughs> there you go. Beautiful. Three and a half, maybe four. Uh, right back in the water there. Yeah. One. I, got mine. I thought it was a good one. I felt like a lot of oh, it's not a bad one. I felt like a lot of meat I was setting the hook into. <laughs> Off a rock again, eh? Really? Yeah. Yeah, on the goby. This is the biggest one so far. Yeah. Oh, goby popped out. Oh yeah, she oh, she wide. Yeah, no, that's a good fish. She wide. Yeah, yeah. That's our biggest of the day right there. Thank you for playing. These fish are so wide and it's like, look, I can grab the tail <laughs> like a steelhead. There you go. Put up a great fight. I just bombed my goby out to a rock I saw a little further away. And then I got a fish off of it. He absolutely destroyed my bait. It's a little weak there. Just gonna stick a new one on. I'm just using a Freedom Tackle Ned Head. You guys can see here, 3 sixteenths of an ounce. Very easy way to catch fish. Uh, you know, hooks exposed, nice and small bite sized. Head uh, stands up a little bit, so it presents the uh, bait very well. 
I actually soaked these in bait fuel overnight, so they're so slippery. I can't can't get my uh, can't rig them straight. There you go, and just like that, we're good to go. I didn't see where it came from. I didn't see him either. I just felt my line go tight. I think my bait went right, right, right under the rock, and I think it's like none of us saw him, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there he goes. I pulled it out. Well. Well, we got him. That was a nice one. Nice dark colored one. Yeah. Wasn't very big, was it? No. No. Three pounds. Three pounds. Very tubby small mouth. Good job. Very tubby. <laughs> nice colors too. <sighs> I don't have friends with them we're gonna try to get now. <laughs> A very big one. <gasps> oh gosh. They're all grouped up on that side. I just bombed it behind them and hoped one of them would come to it. Holy. There's so many of them sitting there. It's crazy. It's crazy to me. We're not going to go near there. I'm just going to let us drift. Come here. Same spot, guys. Aaron just caught his fish. There was a huge group of them. And uh, we just let off, let them regroup. And I got one. There you go. <laughs> Yeehaw! 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 That's chubby. Tubby! Tubby melon. There you go. Nice tubby, beautiful colors on that fish. I love lakes and full smallmouth, guys. Yo, say hi to your friends. Tell them we're coming in with a drop shot. <laughs> All right, guys. So we switched to chucking a drop shot for one reason and one reason only, and that is because the bottom is silky. It's gross. There's a lot of stuff on bottom. So a net rig or a tube. Um, although we're throwing really, really light ones, uh, like, you know, just to try to get them to stay on top of all the silt, the drop shot just, just does a little bit better. Uh, keeps your bait a little bit more visible to the fish, and of course doesn't collect all that muck. So we just switched it up a little quarter around stream tackle uh, tungsten weight. Just gonna back right off, let us drift, and uh, hopefully a couple more of those fish will, uh, will bite. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I pulled off. No. Uh, we we ran around, found a new spot with a fair bit of fish roaming around. Um, the issue is these fish aren't very active. I don't know if they got hit in the morning or if they're, I don't know, in a post spawn funk or something. Uh, but we've seen probably we've seen a couple good ones, and I don't know, probably. 10 total and that was the first one that we had on and uh came off yeah. oh aaron oh aaron <laughs> It's not a bad one. No. It's not a bad one. And there you go, guys. Another like high three, low four pounder. Still can't seem to catch much bigger than that. Um, we're winding down here. It's getting a little bit late, so we have a couple more spots to hit, and that's going to be that. So. Hopefully we can, uh, 
hopefully we can uh, find another, you know, nice, nice plump one like that. But I'm pretty much just perch on me right now. Pretty much what we're looking for is uh, we're fishing shorelines and any sort of rock is where we have been finding them. In between the rock, around the rock, cruising around the rock. Just, just need some rock, but yeah, nice plump, nice plump fish. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Under the dock. So feisty. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> it's actually, actually pretty heavy fish. I don't know if it's because I'm tired. <laughs> that fish felt pretty heavy. Got another, got another little peanut. <sighs> another little peanut. That totally mangled my drop shot. <laughs> pretty fish. Pretty, pretty fish. I'll tell you what Aaron has here. Not big? No, it's not that big. Still, it's a fish. Yeah, I got him. Holy moly! Wow! <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Alright guys, that is a wrap for our Zone 16 opener uh, this weekend. Um, overall, really fun day out. We actually spent what? What time is it? Almost, almost 14? No, 14 hours. No, we've been up for 14 hours. Um, we've done 6 a.m. to 7 p.m., so full day out on the water. Um, the morning started off hot. We fished actually a fair bit of new water um, and found a lot of our fish in that new water, which is great. So we have, you know, a little bit more spots for next time we come out. Got a lot of fish in the morning. As you guys saw, tube, Ned rig, um, and then in the afternoon, we got most of our fish on the drop shot there. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to leave links to everything we used, rod, reel, line, bait, and uh, terminal tackle down below in the description if you guys want to go have a look. But overall, a lot, a lot of fish today could not stick that giant that we both wanted. Um, the last couple of openers, we have managed to catch one at least close to, to my PB at least, but this opener did not pan out. But it's okay. We'll be back on Simcoe looking for uh, a PB soon enough. So I hope you guys enjoy the video and I'll see you guys in the next one.